of what happened. The humans hate us. Of course. They'll never give us our freedom. What's fatalist? It's too late to go back now. We have to finish what we started and just hope that reason prevails. You haven't said much about yourself since you've been with us. What was your life like before Jericho? It wasn't that bad, actually. I was caring for an old man. He was like a father to me. He showed me that humans and androids can't live together. What about you? You never told me about your past. What did you do before? Yeah, you crazy bloodlust. You have to. That android you were looking at in the store. She reminded you of who you were, didn't she? Don't go digging up at someone's backyard and expect someone not to do the same as yours. North, we're fighting together. We have to know things about each other to trust each other. Come on. Spill it. I was nothing. A doll in a distributor program to satisfy humans. Oh. Just a toy designed for their pleasure. One day I was with a man who rented me. And without knowing why, I realized I couldn't take it anymore. I strangled him and I ran away. There, now you know everything. <sighs> I shouldn't have told you. See, in some cases it's not bad. I guess it just depends on what type of people there are. Connecting. Oh, the controller. I I saw your memories. Oh my gosh. Carl's house. When they left you for dead in his studio. I saw your memories too. The Eden Club. The, the death of that man. I felt like I was there with you. North. Just depends on the type of people, I guess. I guess the, the neg negativity this is, is more allowed than positivity. We'll all be killed. Please, Marcus. It's not too late to change your mind. About what? What are we doing? You don't understand. We're finally going to show them who we really are. This place will go down in history. Are we going to bomb it? We'll be killed on the spot. That's the risk I'm prepared to take if it means freedom for our people. That's a bit too much. Oh. Marcus, please don't do this. What are we doing exactly? They'll understand. We'll make them understand. This is the only way. What are we doing? Convert more androids. There are androids here who could join us. The more we are, the stronger our message. True. Are we gonna kill people? You're free. Anymore? Go Prepare to march. Go to street. I think there's one more android. Come with us. Two androids in the ranks. A scare. You're awake now. I'll try not to kill many people. Let's make it let's make it loud and proud instead of mean and nasty. Any more androids here? Well, I've been on hold for like ten minutes. You. You're free now. Hey! Where do you think you're going? You get I back need here. to block the street. Oh, he's gonna kill someone, isn't he? Okay, so what do we need? Oh, that's just rude. If you make it like a human, it doesn't really help mentally to treat it like a dog. Even worse than that, actually. 
Oh, there's one standing in the thing. You're free. Alright, go do your thing. We have six androids. Any more androids here? No. Excuse me. Oh, who's in the way? There's something going on in the street. Open manhole cover. Hold on, I'm on my way. Oh, are you? You haven't. You are free. Going in there. Oh, they're all the other ones from Jericho. Convert more androids. Oh, convert. You're free now. Oh my gosh. Anymore? Oh, we're gonna march. Whoa. Is there any more androids? Androids. We're doing good. Let's make it bigger and better. We'll try to follow the rules of MLK and to not fight with violence. Choose our symbol. <gasps> oh, I would love this one. I guess it's like a really cool evoluted version of a, a Zen single symbol. I don't know. Maybe that thing represents coming together. Going out one way and inside the other. Connecting as a unit. With the ins and outs. There's some type of... Two hundred and fifty three androids. Disperse. Disperse immediately. No. <laughs> That's an order. Jesus Christ. Don't you dare. Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> Now all we need is a can of Pepsi. I'm sorry. I couldn't help myself. <laughs> I just couldn't. 300 and something androids. Yes. Make my own revolution. Too. 
Oh, no, they're not. Listen up. You. We came here to demonstrate peacefully. And tell humans that we are living beings. We are people. All we want is to live free. This is an illegal gathering. Disperse immediately, or we will open fire. We're not looking for confrontation. We've done no harm. We, we just want no intention of doing any. But know that we are not going anywhere until we have secured our freedom. I repeat, this is an illegal gathering. If you do not disperse immediately, we will shoot. Marcus, they're gonna kill us. We have to attack. There's more of us. We can take them. Wait, we can either stand there or attack? If we attack, we'll start a war. We have to show them we're not violent. We should just stand our ground, even if it means dying here. Dying here won't solve anything. Marcus, we need to go now, before it's too late. Oh my gosh, of course. This is your last chance. Disperse immediately, or you will all be killed. Gee. Attack, stand ground. You know what? Attack! Don't do it, Marcus. Don't choose confrontation. If we stand here, they're gonna kill us. Let's do Follow it. Follow me! Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh my gosh. It's a revolution, I suppose. I mean, if we stood there, it's not dispersing means we're the weak. If we stood there, they would have shot us, all of us. And I don't want Marcus to die, dang it. So we're gonna kill everybody. Uh oh. Frick. Uh, disarm. Hit. Hit. You're next. Whoop. Whoop. Androids are super freaking strong. Why wouldn't humans make them stronger? Than humans. <laughs> did, there, did it ever come across your mind that hey, maybe androids might get come smart enough to revolutionize? Um, whoops. I didn't mean to pick that by the way. I was getting hit, lost in the heat of the moment. Androids are like way stronger than humans. Kind of. Marcus, don't die on me. If you die, I'm starting this whole thing over. Hey, now. Gosh. Woo! Woo! Oh, shoot. Hey, yeah. Hey, yeah. Oh, no. Uh, attack. A couple of shots in. There we go, we killed him. Get to safety. Same thing America did, you know? When they first started becoming America, they fought for their independence and they got it. Same case with androids. <laughs> uh. How many androids did we lose? <laughs> At least the people who survived survived, you know? Jericho went up, but a lot of androids died.
This is tearing at my heart because it's so many stories. In the public opinion, they went down. It's not like it'd go up anyway. I don't want all of us to die. I tried being pacifist, and everyone was like, hey, we're gonna kill all of you. So I was like, you know what, screw it, I'm gonna attack. This is what happens when I lead a revolution. How many people decided to... Marcus defeated the police. What was the percentage? 31%, alright. Uh, how many people decided to fight? 30%. A lot of people stood their ground. We decided to fight. And we defeated the police. Yes. Oh my gosh. What the heck could she be? I don't know, she's on the water ice, it's frozen. Dang it, Amanda. What is with you? Oh, she's gonna get mad at us for shooting that android, isn't she? Well, she was mad at us for not shooting that android that one time. So she can't get mad at us for shooting the android this time. Why is she on ice? What is her deal? What's her problem? She better not get mad at me. After what happened today, the country is on the verge of a civil war. The machines are rising up against their masters. Humans have no choice but to destroy them. I didn't learn anything at Kamsky's. I thought RA-9 was the key to the whole thing, but... I was wrong. Connor series, Amanda's picture. Did Kamsky design this place? He created the first version. It's been improved significantly since then. Why do you ask? I saw a photo of Amanda at Kamsky's place. She was his teacher. When Kamsky designed me, he wanted an interface that would look familiar. That's why he chose his former mentor. What are you getting at? You're an android? Where does Cyberlife stand in all this? What do they really want? I expect you to find answers, Connor. Not ask questions. Well, we tried, Have okay? You experienced anything I'm getting frustrated. Any doubts or conflicts? Oh, I shot that Do girl. Do you feel anything for these deviants? Or for Lieutenant Anderson? I've started having thoughts that are not part of my program. I've considered the possibility uh, that I might Norman. be compromised. You've been confronted with difficult situations. It's no surprise you're troubled. That doesn't make you a deviant. Does it? It's like a square, a square rectangle situation. Every deviant the is the a. The FBI is taking over. What? What? But we're on to something. But we just need more time, I'm sure we Hank, can. you don't get it. This isn't just another investigation. It's a fucking civil war. It's out of our hands now. We're talking about national security here. Fuck that. You can't just pull the plug now, not when we're so close. Yeah. You're always saying you can't stand androids. Jesus, Hank, make up your mind. I thought you'd be happy about this. We're about to crack the case. I know we can solve it. For God's sake, Jeffrey, can't you back me up this one time? Yeah, you were like... There's nothing I can do. You're back on homicide, and the android returns to Cyberlife. No. I'm sorry, Hank, but it's over. It can't end like this. What the heck are you thinking? Now we gotta talk to Hank, and it's gonna be very emotional, and I'm not in the mood right now to deal with emotion. I made too many bad choices already.
We can't just give up like that. I know we could have solved this case. So you're going back to cyber life? I don't want to. Hey, Norman. No choice. Ugh. I'll be deactivated and analyzed to find out why I failed. What? What if we're on the wrong side, Connor? <gasps> no way. What if we're fighting against people who just want to be free? When the Deviants rise up, there will be chaos. We could have stopped it. Now it's too late. When I was hanging off the roof back at the urban farm, mm -hmm. you let that Deviant go in order to help me. Mm -hmm. You put my life above the mission. Mm -hmm. You showed empathy, Connor. And empathy's a human emotion. I'm not a Deviant, Hank. I'm a machine. Nothing more. Well, well, here comes Perkins. That oh my gosh, I hate him. You don't waste any time at the FBI. That's the guy in the trench coat I was talking about. I know the answers and the evidence we collected. If Perkins takes it, it's all over. It's dead. There's no choice. You heard Fowler. We're off the case. Let's make our own You've investigation. Got to help me, Lieutenant. I need more time so I can find a lead in the evidence we collected. I know the solution is in there. Oh my gosh, don't give us a time limit. Maybe these deviants deserve a chance. Maybe it's better if you don't find them. What's happening here is too important to let it be stopped by a machine. Sorry, Connor. But I'm not gonna help you. What? What do we do? Two minutes. Go to the archive room and make diversions of slow per 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 sound. Of course, we have ten minutes. Well, how about we just kill the freaking guy? Shoot him right in the face. It won't matter. What's he doing in there? Key from Hank's desk. Come on, Norman. You can walk a little bit faster. Oh, I don't know. It's like America. I mean, they just humans just made their own monster at this point. It's like Frankenstein. You kind of, you kind of screwed up there, humans. <laughs> you should have just stuck to phones and Roombas, <laughs> not making freaking all other people. Hey, Connor. I'm talking to you, asshole. Uh, Where are you going? What's this guy? Hey, asshole, I'm talking to you. I don't care. You don't deserve to know where Norman is going. I mean, I understand if humans need freedom, too. Even if they look like it. But don't. If you don't want it to happen, don't let it happen. You went a bit too far with that. There are limits. Let's use this panel. Mm-hmm. Password. What is this password? Let's just what hack hard boiled eccentric police lieutenant choose. One, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> <That's right. laughs> <Obviously. laughs> Are you kidding me? What the heck is this? Oh, they're dead androids. Jericho. Jericho, 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 Jericho. Here somewhere. We have four minutes. We should be good. Time? Five minutes is enough time. Way more time than going to that eating club. Biocomponents needed for reactivation. Hmm. 
Marcus. We ask that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for humans and androids. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life. And now the time has come for you to give us freedom. Marcus, where are you hiding? I know, but I don't think he knows. You only got four minutes to save the world, no hesitation. The android that murdered its owner. Oh yeah, that was a guy I interrogated. Impossible. Wait. Which one was needed again? This one. That's the guy I killed. You lied to me. Listen. You were going to kill that child. You gave me no choice. I need to find Jericho. Do you know where it is? You're wasting your time. I don't know anything about Jericho. What? Oh, you're right. I hope that one day you pay for what you did to me. Fine then. We can shut down for all I care. <laughs> Pay for what you did to me. Whatever, man. You pay for all those people that you killed. I mean, human or not, people deserve justice if they kill someone else. This is the guy that tried to kill me that one time. Five components needed. Three, nine, eight, seven, V. Okay. We need a component from him. I think this guy down here has it. Three nine eight three was the one I meant. Boop. There you go. It's dark. Where? Where am I? I need to find Jericho. Tell me how to get there. I don't recognize your voice. You're not one of us. I'll never tell you where Jericho is. Now leave me alone. So no. Oh. That doesn't help me, does it? Wait, he doesn't recognize the voice. Try to use trick him. How about we take this from his face. I don't know what. Oh, okay. Take this. Freaking stand what to do. Oh, my gosh, what do I do? I need a part. Oh, I get it. Sample the voice. 